Rebel Rouser. I'm Alan Voivod, and this is Star Wars 7x7. We're at episode number 1748 today. Thank you so much for joining me for it. I'm out in the goo a couple more times. I'm here at McCormick Place West, which, if you're watching the video version of this, you can see what this place looks like after the thrill is gone. And what I mean by that is that you would not know, this is Tuesday afternoon that I'm recording this, and you would not know that for the last five days there has been a massive Star Wars celebration here happening. There is no evidence of it whatsoever. And I took some still photographs that I'll post on my Instagram and Facebook and Twitter accounts for the show, so you can see some various perspectives on just how quickly everything just disappears. And let's just quickly recap. Five days of incredible reveals the Rise of Skywalker and the long-awaited teaser for it. The Mandalorian, the first footage of it, as well as new character information. The first episode of Season 2 of Star Wars Resistance. The reveals of Jedi Fallen Order and more information about Vader Immortal. A bunch of publishing initiatives, including the very mysterious Project Luminous, a return to Vader's castle for IDW Publishing. The list goes on and on, and it's all been covered here on Star Wars 7x7. In fact, the coverage for the show that I did here is record-breaking in terms of what I've done previously. I looked back at it this morning, and it's 15 episodes plus a couple of live streams plus a bunch of stuff posted to Facebook and Instagram stories, which is a first-time thing, and, and we also moved on to a new platform as well, or added a new platform, I should say, which is Instagram TV, IGTV. So for the first time, Star Wars 7x7 has taken over IGTV. So that was you know, pretty exciting as well. And thank you to everybody who has said such wonderful things about the coverage that I provided from Celebration. You know, not everybody gets to be here. I, they had said that it was supposed to be upwards of 35,000 people in attendance at Celebration this time around, but that means that a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of Star Wars fans did not get to come here. So, you know, I'm hopefully playing a, you know, small part in bringing the joy of Celebration to you wherever in the world you may be, and I'm not done. <laughs> not by a long shot. So, Yes, those episodes will live on, and we haven't even talked about the Rise of Skywalker teaser in depth, and so over the next few days, we're going to start slicing and dicing that trailer. Tomorrow, we're going to begin with looking at the seven different possibilities for why we would be hearing Emperor Palpatine's laughter in the Rise of Skywalker teaser. That's the first of a few that we're going to do about the trailer. And beyond that, well, you know, for you know, those of you who have listened to the show, watched the show over the past couple of years, you know that I do interviews here at Celebration, and you may have heard me announce the interview question before Celebration began, which is when it comes to Star Wars, what do you know for sure? Well, I'm going to tell you everybody who will be appearing on the show over the next couple of weeks, and I'll tell you about that after the break. Stay tuned. Hey there. If you're enjoying all the coverage that I'm bringing you from Star Wars Celebration and what I do every single day for you at Star Wars 7x7, I hope you'll consider putting something in the tip jar at patreon.com slash sw7x7. $1, 327, 501 or more. Honestly, every little bit helps and every little bit is just as exciting as every other little bit. Please consider supporting me in the work of delivering Star Wars stories and interviews to you on a daily basis at patreon.com slash SW7X7. Welcome back. All right, so I am pleased to announce that we have 25 interviews coming up over the next few weeks from Star Wars Celebration. And I'm going to tell you who they all are. It's going to come fast and furious, and I'm going to have to check my notes because this is crazy. So Paul Duncan, the author of the Star Wars Archives, Mark Newbold from Fanta Tracks and Star Wars Insider, Michael Siglane, the creative executive and director of Lucasfilm Publishing, Tony Fleece, who is an artist with IDW Comics. Cole Horton and Liz Heineke, who work for DK or write for DK. Jason Fry, who also writes for DK, as well as the author of many books, including The Last Jedi Expanded Edition. Matthew Reinhardt, who does Star Wars pop-up books. Chris Reif and Chris Trevis, who have done lots of graphic illustration work, including, for example, the Haynes Manuals of the Millennium Falcon. Lauren Peterson, the legend from ILM. 
Uh, Mark Thompson, the voice narrator for many audiobooks. Uh, Kevin Scott, author. Nick Martarelli, an audiobook producer. Steve Kirk, podcaster for San Diego Sabres. Clayton Sandell, the Star Wars correspondent for ABC News. Dan Zare of Coffee with Kenobi. Amy Rickow from 365 Days of Star Wars Women. Dennis Keithley from Starship Sabres and Scoundrels. Zoraida Cordova, another Star Wars author. Justina Ireland, another Star Wars author. Steve Sansweet from Rancho Obi-Wan. Tom Spina of Regal Robot and Tom Spina Designs. Tim McMahon of Less Than 12 Parsecs and... Rob Breedow, the head of ILM. So that is who you have to look forward to in the coming weeks here on Star Wars 7x7. And with every interview, I'm gonna also share with you the story of how I met up with these folks and you know any interesting stories that go along with the interview itself that happened before or after that sort of thing. So anyway, after we get through our discussion of the trailer, we will dive into the interviews beginning next week. So that's what you have on tap for Star Wars 7x7. So the magic of Star Wars Celebration is going to last all the way to May the 4th and beyond. So that is going to do it for today's episode of the show. Thank you so much for joining me for it, as always. And may the Force be with you, wherever in the world you may be. This podcast is not endorsed or sponsored yet by Lucasfilm Limited, Disney, or 20th Century Fox. It is intended for entertainment and information purposes only. Star Wars, the Star Wars logo, all names and pictures of Star Wars characters, vehicles, and any other related Star Wars items are registered trademarks and or copyrights of Lucasfilm Limited or their respective trademark and copyright holders. May the Force be with them. All original content is copyright 2019 by Star Wars 7x7. We hope you love it.